Are you thinking about moving to New Jersey? Why would you do that? This place sucks. I mean, haven't you seen the headlines? So why is it that year after year after year, New Jersey is the most hated state in the country? How could such a small state cause such a huge controversy? Well, I'm here today to tell you exactly why. Why does New Jersey always have a reputation of being the worst place in the country to live? Truth be told, Jersey isn't the greatest place in the world. Honestly, kind of sucks. My name is Corey. I'm a local real estate agent here in Monmouth County, New Jersey, and I pride myself as being an extremely honest real estate agent. So yes, there are some pretty crappy things about New Jersey, but just so you know, there are also some amazing things about the Garden State. So I figured I would kick off a short series all about New Jersey and this week, I would start with the bad, the ugly, and the not so good stuff. So here are my top eight reasons why you should absolutely not even think about moving to New Jersey. Number one, obnoxious people and language. Seriously? Like, what the f Talk about insulting. What exactly do people mean when they say obnoxious? Does that mean that people from Jersey want what they want when they want it? We expect things to get done and get done at a fast pace. We don't really like to wait for things. The people in New Jersey are often stereotyped as rude. No way. We're just direct. We tell the truth and we're kind about it. Okay, so maybe not always kind. I mean, yeah, people can be rude, but does that mean all of us? I'm from New Jersey. I'm pretty nice, right? I mean, holy crap, don't be so judgmental. I'll admit it, people here in New Jersey, we may not be the most patient people in the country, and we all have our moments. So seriously, if you're looking for super happy, pappy, nice, polite people 24 seven, do not move to New Jersey. Moving on to another reason why you just do not want to think about moving to New Jersey. The cost of living here is ridiculous. It's freaking expensive here in the Garden State. I mean, we're 25% higher than most of the country. But remember, our salaries are significantly higher here. Big whoop, does that even matter? You may find this fact quite interesting. Although New Jersey is super expensive, there are actually four other states that are more expensive to live in than the Garden State. Coming in at number one is Hawaii, followed by New York, Massachusetts, and California and then New Jersey. So that's pretty good news, right? So if you don't love the thought of extremely high costs of living, New Jersey is not the state for you. Coming in at number three, traffic and driving. People absolutely love to complain about the traffic here in New Jersey, especially during the summer months. But you know what? You know why there's so much traffic here during the summer months? Because we have some incredible beaches here at the Jersey Shore. So do me a favor, just relax. Enjoy sitting in bumper to bumper traffic, getting up at the crack of dawn so you can try to get a parking spot at one of our amazing beaches. Another thing, be sure you stay in the right lane when driving. Us New Jerseyans, we take our driving seriously here. Nothing pisses them well, us off more than a New York or Pennsylvania plate invading our space. We are always in our cars in New Jersey and we want to get from point A to point B with no incidents and a smooth, easy ride. We take our driving so serious here in New Jersey, we refer to almost any location 
by your exit number off the Garden State Parkway. Coming in at the number four reason not to move to New Jersey are roadways. Now let me tell you something. Not only do the majority of our roads totally suck, they are freaking expensive to travel on. You would seriously think with all the money we pay in tolls to drive on the roads that they'd actually be in much better shape. And after a bad winter here, buckle up because you'll be in your car driving along singing and boom, you are hitting a pothole. Let's just say this Jersey girl, I have popped many a tire while driving here in the wonderful state of New Jersey. So if you are not into having to pay crazy tolls to get on and off of roads that are pretty crappy anyway, and you don't enjoy changing and putting on a spare tire every once in a while, New Jersey, not the place for you. Up next, let's talk about the politics here in New Jersey. Listen, I'm gonna catch some serious crap if I dive too deeply into the subject of politics. But let's just say, I don't care if you're red or blue or violet skies, this man right here, ugh. So let's just say, politically, New Jersey can be quite a challenging place. Although you know, I could go on and on and on about this subject, and I would love to, but I know better. So coming in at number six, the crazy weather we have here in New Jersey. So yes, we are absolutely blessed to have all four seasons here in New Jersey. But did you know sometimes we get all four seasons in one week? It can be 80 degrees and sunny, and then boom, next thing you know, it snows. To be fair, this seems to be a new trend for us. I remember, definitely remember being younger and experiencing winter, spring, summer, and fall. But boy, have things changed here. And let's also be honest, it's hot as hell here in the summer and it's freaking freezing in the winter. So if you're looking for that 60 to 70 degree temperature all year long and you don't want to have to deal with shoveling snow or wearing snow boots and a bathing suit in the same week, New Jersey's not the place for you. Coming in at number seven, taxes. New Jersey is ranked number one, numero uno in property taxes out of all the states in the entire country. We're number one, number one. I mean, we did okay when it came time to income taxes. We were ranked as the third highest state in the country. So that's like winning something. There is not a lot of room for a discussion on the subject regarding taxes. If you are not all about paying ridiculously high taxes, absolutely do not think about moving to New Jersey because our taxes are ridiculous, out of control, and there's nothing we can do about it. We just pay them. And finally, the eighth reason not to consider moving to the state of New Jersey, we share sports teams. Come on, it's so freaking stupid. It's the New York Jets. It's the New York Giants. They both play in New Jersey. They both play in the Garden State. And they both stink. That it's the New York Yankees and the New York Mets. We don't even have a New Jersey team. We have to share our teams with New York. What about the New York Red Bulls and NYCFC? I mean, we do have the New Jersey Nets and the New Jersey Devils. Big deal. I mean, why is it that Philadelphia can get all its own teams and we have to share ours? It's so annoying. So there are just some of my reasons why I think the state of New Jersey totally sucks. I told you at the beginning of the video, I like to keep things honest and real and I couldn't be any more honest than I was in this video, could I? 
but there are also some incredibly amazing and fantastic things that the state of New Jersey has to offer. And I will do a video about those in the next few weeks. So I hope you check back. If you have any questions at all about the state of New Jersey and anything that has to do with Monmouth County, real estate, places to go, some of the best restaurants in the area, or which beaches I think are worth visiting, just drop a message in the comment section below and I will be sure to get in touch with you. Thank you so much for joining me this week and I will see you next time.